Well, it's easy to forget sometimes that words have great power, and the owner of the Detroit Barbecue Company is learning that lesson the hard way. Tonight, in an exclusive interview, he's apologizing for his Facebook post that slammed police officers. Seven investigator Jonathan Carlson has more. Well, good evening. This is a lesson in social media. Be careful what you post. I won't apologize. Tim Idzikowski says he's sorry after what he posted on his personal Facebook page. The post came after those two NYPD officers were murdered in retaliation for the recent killing of an unarmed black man there. Idzikowski posted this of cops. How many times did they think they were going to kick the hornet's nest before they got stung? These guys can't breathe now either. When Detroit cops started responding to his post, he replied, Two cops get killed and it's a blank tragedy, but you guys can run around killing people without fear of any reprisals because of your blank badge and it's business as usual. Why don't you try suck starting your service pistol? DPD and its unions are responding. We're going to have people who are a little more vocal than others with respect to those who make uh, disparaging comments toward uh, law enforcement or uh, make off-color comments about uh, police officers. Well, you know, that's, I hate to say it, but that's their, that's their own personal cross to bear. I think right now is a time of mourning where our nation should be coming together, not uh, fighting against one another. They have a right to freedom of speech. A lot of times people post things on social media and gives them a sense of self-importance. They're looking for a response and people give it to them. Why don't you try suck starting your service pistol? What did that mean? What did you mean by that? That was too. Idzikowski is clearly still upset over the comments and he says he made that one after threatening posts from a cop. Some would say that's telling a cop to put a gun in his mouth. What was your motivation in saying what you said? I had read some other posts on, on social media and I was frustrated. With the fallout that's come from this, some would say you have it coming to you. Do you agree with that? I shouldn't have said what I said. I did not mean to take down a whole profession. I, in no way. Well, come on, some of those comments come across as kind of hateful. If I'm a cop looking at them. I didn't mean to disrespect or offend anyone who serves as a police officer. I have partners, I have employees, and, and they don't deserve this. Do you understand the response? I do. Um, I could see how the comments I made could be viewed um, as in, in a negative light. The Detroit Barbecue Company caters a lot of big events in Metro Detroit. Some of the clients saying today that they're severing ties with the company. However, the owner telling me tonight, give me another shot. Jonathan Carlson, 7 Action News.